Okay, here's Grandview Drive, Peoria. President Theodore Roosevelt said it was the most beautiful drive in the country. I have not been on it before now. So uh, let's hope he's right. I'm sure it's going to be cool, though. Lori's driving, so I can be hands-free or whatever. <laughs> or I, can, I can use both hands doing this if I want, because I'm not driving. It's great. Nice and legal. <laughs> So far, it is very pretty. And it reminds me of uh, uh, the Smoky Mountains. But it's here in Illinois, right by the uh, Illinois River. Oh, my ears just popped. Just kidding. It didn't really. It's very cool, though. speed never mind <laughs> this is great you say again it's the first time I've ever been here to, to take Grandview Drive I've been to Peoria a lot but, uh, I wanted to see how grand the view actually is honestly this was Lori's idea and it was a good idea a little day trip in the fall before the weather gets bad let's see or something or other. That's probably where the public bathroom is. Emergency management, maintenance. Yeah, the bathrooms are really not important. Another nice view down that way. Sort of cliff like. <laughs> uh, Grandview Drive Park. Oh, that correction. That's probably where the public restroom is if I needed to use it, which I don't. Then there's someone's house. Okay. Now there's some nice overlooks that we have yet to actually get to, but we're going to before the end of uh, the day. I honestly, I'm trying to decide if I want to split up the video a little bit. But uh, here's one of the first overlooks. Very neat. Oh man, it's really cool. Uh, wow. Yeah, it's just a panorama of beauty of the river for a moment. Uh, there's some neat architecture over there. Old, like, 1830s or whatever house would be my guess. And some sort of real steep drop down there toward the river. Very pretty overall. <clears throat> Desirable properties. Very exclusive neighborhood, I think we could say. I know that's pretty too. No, oh, that is really, really nice. Well, you'll have to pause and zoom in, whatever, if you want to see a better view of that. <laughs> and wow, look at that. That's cool. Would you look at this? Would you look at that? <laughs> yeah, that's really something. That's great. And I think there's an overlook to park at here. Looks that way. Yeah. Okay, we can actually park and I'm gonna get out and uh, give everybody an even better treat. We got picnic benches, garbage can, and an overlook. I just ended the seatbelt. You can hear the seatbelt warning. Okay. And you want some beauty, huh? Here you go. I'm surprised there's no platform or whatever. Or any of those uh, little telescopes like at Starve Rock. Yeah, I wouldn't try walking down to the water from here. I'd, I would certainly likely fall if I tried to walk down there. It's uh, not easy to get the best view of it. I'm sneaking in for a second. Whoops. <laughs> Just your back. No one saw your... They don't know who you are. Well, yeah, they do, but... Anyway, you didn't really want in the video, but... I snuck you in anyway, because I love you. All right. Yeah, there's some nice bluffs on the other side there.
I don't know, I hope you're getting a good idea of what this looks like in person because it's really, actually, it's really awesome. So that's the Illinois River. There's some uh, better overlooks further north along the river and along Grandview Drive. We'll get to that. You ready to go back? Okay. Oh, there's a little marker she pointed out. Thank you. You can, you can speak if you want. Uh, oh, <laughs> here's our latitude and longitude. Thank you, geodetic survey. You see number one? Yeah, okay. Nope, you all can have fun trying to interpret all that. I'm not good at that stuff. My father would be. He was better at the military style navigation than I am. Pretty cool though. Can we continue on the, hey, wait, hey, you wanna, driver, <laughs> come back please. <laughs> I wanna make Marissa my video. Whoops, got you again. <laughs> This is awesome. And it's, yeah, very pretty. And there's more to it. We haven't got to the best part yet, as far as I understand. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, get, in, get into the car, please. Yeah, let's, let's continue further. There's more Grandview Drive to see. All right. It's great, though. I'm trying to keep it from being boring to everybody. All right. <laughs> I'm trying to have it fun, fun and exciting. It's very exciting. And also, there's a lot of mansions on this. There are many mansions. I've already highlighted some of the architecture. Yeah, it's uh, it's the whole plan. See the mansions and the landscape. And if there's a cool dog or something, you're gonna know about it, everybody. For real. Oops. I tried to put someone's car in there. I didn't mean to do that. I'm not interested in these people's vehicles. Now, if I saw a really cool car, that'd be different, but it's just average traffic. I gotta do my belt. Okay. And safely go out and just follow Grandview. I don't remember how far it goes from here. There's a kind of a cool mansion. Huh. All right, there you go. There are many. It's an exclusive property. Yeah, that's it's a desirable location for the people that don't have to get out and commute every morning because imagine coming down the hill in the winter a danger a bit danger hill i wouldn't even want to walk on some of this in the winter time you'd fall down a big old cliff practically hitting every tree along the way maybe not we had some neat old buildings for sure yeah i mean if if i think roosevelt was a pretty well respected president and he's the one who created the national park service so he, he knows about beauty. That's very, very nice, yes. Okay, I'll take a look at that too. That's cool, nice mansion. It's great. Can't really get a good view because of the trees and stuff. There's another one. Great, nice man. That's some definitely scenic area. There's another one over there, look at that. I could only see the chimneys really. And that's, wow, that's quite a drop down there, boy. Yeah, this is the old money Peoria area right there, you know. <laughs> Millionaire Row or whatever, yes, at least, probably. Yeah, it, in the mid-1800s, it was Millionaire Row. It's probably like closer to Billionaire Row now, but I don't know. But it's sure a nice view. It's a very nice view. Yeah, the main overlook is coming up ahead still. great I, I'm hoping that everybody enjoys this that's my main goal is for people to be in, entertained and enjoy it it looks like they have a country club at the top here they probably do yeah it kind of looks like I think I've seen it on the map without really thinking about it like Peoria Golf and Country Club or whatever I believe that's what that is and they even got tennis courts yeah that's most likely what that is anyway uh, yeah, continue to the left there. No, that's well, you can go to the overlook. Yeah, that's probably the main this is overlook. Roosevelt Road. No, huh. Roosevelt Road, and it is the Country Club of Peoria. Okay. Well, it makes sense. Well, of course, it's an exclusive neighborhood. It's the Country Club right there. Wow. Which is, you know, if this is, where this is good. 
This is where he said it's the most beautiful place in the country or something like that. Okay, well, I'm gonna go check it out so I get that. Know what he got to see. Sort of. And it has a better, a better overlook right here than before. And there's no tra there is a trash can right, right there, 10 feet away, or 20 feet away maybe. And some jag off did that. That's all right. I'll get it before I leave, because I care. I'm just a good citizen sometimes. I've had people say, well, the earth is gonna outlast humanity. Well, it probably will, but why leave it ugly if you can fix it? I like pretty better than ugly. Most people do. There's a little golf cart path that I bet down there. Let's <laughs> see. Is that, over there? is that Pekin over there? Yeah, Pekin's south of Peoria. I don't know what that is over there. It's might be Peoria Heights, it might be Chillicothe. Those are nearby, you have a phone look on your map. I don't know all the, I haven't memorized it all, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry if I sound like a jerk too, I don't mean to. Uh, which, I don't even know which one you're pointing at. There's, there's some Caterpillar facilities too. I think I see three water towers that might just be for Caterpillar. Caterpillar is kind of a big deal in this area, or at least used to be. I don't remember if they're even still here. I think I heard they were moving away. But, uh, I don't know every dot on the map when I can when I'm looking at it in real life it's different than on the map uh, now there's Peoria and there's uh, Peoria Heights Mossville Chillicothe further north and I don't know which one you're even pointing at so I'm sorry there's more of Grandview Drive you want to go check it out and yeah I, I oh there's a memorial bench it's for David Stephen Bash. He saw the beauty in this world and the greatness in every person. He lived his life fearlessly, joyfully, and passionately. Well, that's good. That's a nice memorial. Surprised no one's graffitied it or anything yet. And yeah, I did. I really did pick up somebody's beer and throw it out. I'm about to anyway. I'm like a hero. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sometimes I'm a little full of myself, I guess. I hope I'm not too badly like that. Oops, the car's unlocked. Or, the car is still locked, but now it's unlocked. Thank you, honey. Okay. Okay, and again, what a, what a pretty area. Illinois River. Okay, I'm gonna do my belt again. There's the rules. Good luck reading that. <laughs> anyway, golf cart path. It's a country club, remember? That's got to be a golf cart path. Maybe a walking path. Too, but it's, this is the country club right there, so we can't go there. You have to have a lot more money than we do. I know it's a nice house. It does look sort of castle-like. It's a people often refer to their home as their castle. It's even got the gargoyles. It's even got the. It's got towers and flags and everything, yep, and gargoyles, and it's got the castle-looking towers there, whatever. And look at those gargoyles, wow. <laughs> wow, pretty cool. Okay, watch your driving, please. I think there's still one more big overlook that's, that's the actual big deal around here that we've seen some nice little taste of it, and that's a pretty house, too. And yeah, those, that's really cool. Very antique. That one looks more like a barn, but it's still pretty nice. Uh, that one's nicer, but not as nice as that other one. Whatever I'm in, right? But I think the actual pinnacle is a little further north. Uh, I don't know, this might be it. You know what? I, no, it's okay, just keep going. Just keep going. Okay. Yeah, let's see what else there is. I'm sorry if I was a pain. I don't mean to be. I felt on the spot. Like, what is that down there? I was like, I don't know. I've never been here before. But looking on the map, I mean, I'm trying to get an idea of what's nearby. I mean, I know there's, again, Peoria Heights, Mossville, Chillicothe. Those are the ones I remember right this second. There's people having a picnic. I'm going to leave them out. Another very nice house. Yeah, it is. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm <laughs> nice Honda too. Yes, yeah, so I'm. I'm here for the landscape and the water, you know, the river and all that. The houses are neat though. Okay, there's someone. I'm not gonna put her in the video. Sitting on a bench. Looks like my car. I'm not gonna put that in either. Uh, yeah, we might have already gone. That might have been the the best view back there. I don't feel like stopping at that one. There, there. That's probably it right ahead. Straight ahead, it looks like. Right up here, see? That's probably the, the best one. Like the main one. And I'll, maybe you could check your map on your phone. To, it's even got signs. This is the main one. This has got to be the main one. I remember it being like the furthest north. Okay, this is parked. Definitely parked enough. Okay. What? What does that say? <laughs> Pim to a. What is that? What is that supposed to? Pimaidui. Oh, Pimaidui Trail. Oh, is that it? Is that it right there? Right that, wow, I'm not going on that. That's look, looks looks pretty cool, but it's not a loop. If you hike it, your return trip will be on the same path. If the trail needs maintenance, call us. That's pretty cool. It's meaning fat lake. Pimatue means fat lake. Illinois and Indian name, no native name for Peoria Lake. Here past Joliet and Marquette. Yeah, Louis Joliet and Per Marquette, I believe, were the names of the people. In 1673, established near the lake or Fort Crevecourt, 1680. Fort St. Louis, 1691 to 92. Old Peoria's Fort and Village from 1730. Peoria, Peoria's 1778. Fort Clark, 1813. French Trading House, Opa Post, uh, before 1818, which is when Illinois was founded as a state or recognized as a state, whatever. Americans uh, settled on the site of the city of Peoria in 1819. Illinois State Historical Society put that together. And here's the view from it, which is, I think it's great. It's a good view. I'm surprised they don't have the little telescopes here. And I don't know if it doesn't look like much to you. I'm sorry. I hope you like it though. It's really neat for me and I have never been here before to this very spot. There are no maps in the map thing. There's a little map there. It's pretty cool. I'm not taking that that walk. Well, I actually feel pretty good today. I'm still not doing it. It's about to rain. It's sort of raining right now. Now I'm gonna look at this. Illinois River Road sign. And this is what Roosevelt said, the world's most beautiful drive, 1910. Someone drove him along Grandview to the country club. He attended a luncheon. Yeah, <laughs> uh, you can pause it and read it if you like. Okay, sorry, I'm not gonna spend the time reading the whole thing. If you're still wa watching this, thank you very much. I'm trying to give everybody something good. Because somebody needs to try and preserve, document, share, and teach about this stuff. Because if you don't, it's going to go away. Someone will take it away. If we don't, if we don't honor it, someone will take it away. 